Hi, I'm Alicia. Welcome to another vlog from High Peak Steels. Over the years, we've had numerous conversations with customers on what the commercial straightness tolerance is on bright and black bar. So we thought it would be worthwhile explaining what the British standard says and what is permissible. We want to show you the difference between bright drawn, bright peeled, and black hot rolled bar. So let's take a look at a bright drawn example. Hi, I'm Liam. Bright drawn mild steel or material with a carbon content of less than 0.25% will give you a straightness tolerance of one in one meter on round bar. On bright drawn flats and squares, it is only one in 500 mil. Look at this bright drawn bar as an example. Anything with a carbon content over 0.25%, like EN8 or EN24T in bright bar, the straightness tolerance is only one in 500 mil on round bar, so it can essentially be six millimeter out over the three full meter bar. On bright drawn flats and squares, it is actually worse at only one in 375 mil. Now let's have a look at bright peeled or turn bar straightness tolerances. Bright peeled and reeled bar up to three inch or 75 mil is as good as drawn bar. So one in one meter is easily achievable because it can be reeled straight after turning or peeling. The problem normally occur when the standard peeling or turning process is required for sizes 80 mil up to 200 mil diameter. The material is then turned from black hot roll bar and is not normally reeled or straightened before or after the process. This means where you can only achieve a black bar straightness tolerance as it peels down the length of the bar. As an example of that, we can show this 100 mm diameter bright bar that has been turned that can have a 2.5 millimeter bend in every meter. So up to 15 millimeter out over a six meter bar. So let's look at the British standard straightness tolerance on black hot roll bar. The standard tolerance from 25 mil up to 250 mil is 2.5 mil in every one meter. This means the bar could be up to 15 millimeter out of straightness over a six meter length and still be in tolerance. If you look at this small bar here, there is a bend to the naked eye at the end of the bar, but it could still be in tolerance. With all of these examples and the advice given, we want you to know that most of the time our material will come with tighter tolerances than we have mentioned today. All the examples we have shown are worst case scenario. So if the straightness is of utmost importance on your inquiry or order, please let us know so then we can advise you on what is available and select a bar that's hopefully within the tolerance you are looking for. Thank you for watching and we hope to see you 
next time with another vlog from High Peak Sales. Bye for now.